What's up people, welcome back to the channel. It's been so long time since we did a review of a bike and uh, yes, we at last got our hands on the TVA's Apache RR310. Uh, I've been waiting for reviewing this bike for a very long time. Uh, before I start with the review, I'd like to thank uh, Keshwin TVS, which is located in Sholigna Lod, uh, who have given their test ride bike for us to go out and review it. And thank you so much Keshwin for the wonderful service and a special thanks to Mr. Vishwa, who's my brother from another mother, who's been really, really helpful in getting this bike for review. Uh, and uh, he had to reach out to many levels and he has got it done. So thanks, uh, Vishwa, once again. So yes, guys, we have the TVS Apache RR310 here, which is the black edition. Uh, you can also call it as a titanium black model, which we have right now. Uh, pretty happy about the fact that I got a chance to ride this bike because it's been a long dream for me to go out and test this bike how it performs because I've uh, you know heard a lot and lot of stories about TVS Apache 310 RR and uh, today when I rode uh, to our beautiful you know ECR here you know I felt the uh, pleasure in riding the bike because of the comfort because of the smoothness because of the po aggressive power also it gives when we move to the sports mode let's quickly get into the video and we'll see what all the features are there first i'll give you a basic specs about the bike this bike is it's called as 310 rr uh, but the cubic centimeter of the bike is around 312 cc bike we will go it as category first we'll go in the french section and then we'll go to the mid section and we'll, then we'll go to the tail section and we'll see what all the features are available pose that we'll go for the right and i'll show you what the performance is so once we switch on the key you know we have the drl which is available on both the ends you know which is really unique and it looks really nice and then uh, if you uh, currently see what is the kind of uh, headlamp they use as a bi led projector which is around 30 watts we can go out and see the power of the light it's it's projector light and henceforth you know it looks really nice and stunning during the night time so the front uh, tire size is going to be 110 or by 70 and it's a rim r r17 model it's a 54 h tubeless tire which is really helpful during long rides and the rear tire is 150 60 r17 uh, 66 h uh, tubeless tire the front uh, disc plate is around 300 millimeter petal type with ABS uh, option available and the rear disc also is 240 mm uh, petal type with ABS available. So the engine type is around it's a four stroke uh, four valve engine it's a single cylinder which is liquid fueled and it's reverse inclined. The engine capacity is around as I discussed it's 312.2 cc. The muffler which is available is a single pipe and a single body design and the gearbox is six speed and the fuel tank is around 11 liters which has been used in the bike. So the console of uh, TVS Apache RR310 is really stunning and beautiful. We have a lot of information available in the console. So basically if you see we have the uh, RPM meter on the top and then we have the speedometer which is digital. Uh, we have the mode what is available which mode we are in and we have the coolant temperature, the odometer temperature and then we have the top speed and the fuel range available here. And it's a 5 inch display so it looks really nice uh, when, when you need to ride uh, through the roads. And also we have the gear indicator which is available here so it keeps changing and it goes up to the sixth gear which is available we have the fuel meter here so we have the temperature meter here so it's a, it's a very unique and a good design what uh, uh, tbs have done and if you see the control for the buttons is available on the left hand side and on the right hand side we just have the kill switch we have controls which can be set so this is the hazard light 
so this is very useful for tourists when they go for touring uh, and henceforth you know it can be used uh, very easily and then we have the indicators available on the uh, bottom and we have the horn which is a stock tvs horn i'll just uh, honk it for you guys but it is loud enough for people to hear and it it sounds really well as well and then we have the headlight uh, pass switch and also the headlight on switch on the top which is really helpful this is not an adjustable uh, clutch what has been provided in apache 310 rr and then this is the modes what you can select so the when you when i click on set i get this option here in the display which is actually the range the coolant temperature the rpm what's in right now the ride mode trip details my vehicle preference and you can navigate through these buttons up and down so it keeps navigating like this so after trip details my vehicle preference so these are the four menu options which come so you have four modes which is urban rain sport and track which is available you can set either of it so once you select the option you have to click on here which is available in the console once it's done you'll get a message saying it's been set and you are moved to the sports mode to get back to the old screen you need to press the back button here so with that it's done we are in the sports mode right now so the whole complete uh, design changes so it's like the rpm and the fuel gauge everything keeps uh, it completely changes according to sports mode and then after that we have the trip details once you click this click on set you have trip a trip b trip c and day trip meet all these options available and then going to my vehicle we'll have what is the serious next uh, service which is available and then performance record and you have the documents also available here so you have the bluetooth here so this is the device name what is for the bike and you can pair it with your phone so once you receive a call or something it will come in the display uh, we will not be able to show you that because uh, this particular vehicle's engine chassis number we don't have it in hand for for us to pair it in our mobile app but it, it uh, there are a lot of options available in the mobile app if possible i'll try to get log into that and see if i can get the bike details and add it up and we it will have display calls on and off so we have the option to go ahead and disable and enable it and then we have the display setup what kind of brightness clock date day or night mode all these options are available we have the custom widgets which is like widget one cool and temperature what kind of widgets do you want we have the speed alert so the speed alert is set at 100 so we can set it to maybe let's say 150 and give it on set so only after 150 you touch uh, the, the you will start getting an alarm here so right now we are in say, sports mode we will quickly go ahead and set it to urban mode which is our city mode so this is how it looks so guys we have seen a lot about the technical specs of the apache rr310 you know and uh, really astounding that you know we have so good features available in this bike for for the price bracket it's been given two more points which needs to be discussed one with regards to the seating posture or you can also say it is the ergonomics um, how it feels when you ride the bike you know on, on the road you know uh, how, is it comfortable for long touring when you are stand still you know you can reach your feet easily to the ground because the height uh, that is the i mean say the ground clearance is not so large that i need to keep my feet like this you can place it straight and then when you ride the bike it's going to be a very sportive posture which is also called ergonomics so you will sit like this and you'll ride and initially i thought maybe i may have some pain in the hip but i did not have because it has a very good amazing seating cushion which has been provided with the bike so if, if you're going to be a single solo rider it's going to be really comfortable because the seat is pretty large for the rider you know and it's very comfortable uh, i had a road around 25 kilometers no issues uh, it was comfortable i i didn't feel it i felt the punch of riding it more only so this is an overall feedback about the posture it has and the way the frame has been made which is a thumbs up to tvs and the last and final point before we start with our you know on road test we're going to check the sound of the exhaust it's kind of pretty different you know i felt that the exhaust would have been like uh, really really kind of you know numble but it, they produced it in a very aggressive way i'll quickly show you how it sounds so this is the idle sound what it provides and when i rev the bike it's going to be something different so guys we are going to start our uh, ride review so one two three go so guys uh to be very honest tvs apache ata 310 you know rr 310 you know it's, it's a very beautiful bike so it's very smooth the engine is very refined and smooth and uh, it's very comfortable to ride there's no much vibration which i can feel actually uh, and it's very uh would say like uh, agile to handle so basically if you see uh though it's a fared bike it's easy to you know nimble and you can easily play around with the 
you know bike we have a lot of option i'll quickly show you right now uh, we are in urban mode if i try to change it to rain and click on set it will not set because it's showing close throttle so that means i have to remove uh, loosen the throttle and then i it moves to rain urban is selected i come back and uh, now i'm going to quickly raise it till 80 so it just took a fraction of a second to reach uh, the 77 to 80 range you know uh, in urban now let's quickly go ahead and check the sports mode now it's in sports mode complete in, uh, look of the console changes so if i'm going from third year it was even more quicker right now because the whole uh, what is the performance of the bike changes when you change the into sports mode and uh, let's try though it's not a track let's try the track option i'll lose in this one select come back so this is the track so again if you see the track design looks really really different it looks aggressive and nice So many people do ask this question like when we change these modes does the mileage get impacted uh, yes it does get changed so urban mode is something like a city ride mode you know you you will get a good mileage but when it's come to sports mode and track mode it's a completely different mileage and then when it goes to uh, let's say the rain mode the mileage is going to be a bit better because it does a great job so the performance is really high uh, the looks is really good the way of electrical instruments used is completely amazing uh, the design of the bike was good the puff the braking is good the seating is good it's used for multiple modes so everything seems to be on the positive note you know i i, I feel you know we are good to say that TVS RTR 310 uh, is, is a very good looking machine, is a worth buying machine. Uh, before we go ahead and you know uh, conclude this video, I'd like to take this opportunity uh, to thank uh, Kishwin uh, Motors as well as uh, Vishwa who's been uh, supporting us to get this bike for our review uh, and also accepting the timeline taken for getting the review done. So thank you so much uh, guys, uh, really sweet of you and uh, hoping to do a lot of lot of TVS bikes going forward not only bikes even the scooters guys so thank you so much guys uh, for all the support and love uh, i'll see you in the next video